the Aries Sun Moon and Rising sign. Um, this is wonderful. Um, this is the week where your zodiac sign you're going to start with your birthday, you Aries. So this is wonderful. So on Wednesday, things are going to be start to looking up for you guys. It is the twelfth week of the year. The week begins from the 19th until the 25th. And in this week, we are going to look at the situations that are coming in for you. Monday and Tuesday is going to be very emotional. Whatever the situation is, it's going to be very emotional. And then we have um, the energy on um, Wednesday, which the energies are going to be getting better for you, Aries, especially for the birthday people, okay? So let's look at Monday to see what you Aries have. You Aries have the energy of the King of Swords. Okay, so let's see what is coming in on Tuesday. You have the energy of the Seven of Pentacles. So the King of Swords and the Seven of Pentacles. Then on Wednesday, we have the energy of the Two of Pentacles. So it's all about money problems in this week. Then we are having... Um, the energy of the Queen of Swords. So, okay, your week. Um, your week is going to be crowned by the Queen of Swords. So let's see what is coming in on Friday. You have the energy of the Eight of Cups. And let's see. Let's get the glasses on. Yep, four, four of cups. You have some regrets. You have got some regrets. Saturday, <laughs> the energy of uh, um, the hermit comes in. You need to take a look at yourself. On on um, on on Sunday, um, it's as if nothing is working for you no one wants to be working with you so okay um what is happening is your karma is returning to you okay whatever that you have done to other people your karma is returning to you your karma is returning to you whatever and it's, it's you know for the people who have been doing good for other people and doing good in your life it's going to be good um, for you but for the people who have given out karmas because here you're seeing that at the beginning of the week you have the energy of the king of swords and you're having regrets um and the seven of pentacles coming up so there is going to be a lot of question for you guys because in the first half of the week you're seeing the first part of the week you're seeing that you have a regrets of something that you did with a king with, with, with the king of um the king of sword the king of sword is someone who is an um an aquarius a gemini or a libra um you have some regrets what you did with him then when we look at the middle of the week you have the situation with the seven of pentacles and the hermit and the hermit wants you to look at what you have done and what has transpired okay because now you're trying to balance out your financial situation so you did something that you had regrets with it's as if you sold out someone or you um you sold out someone to the um to the king of swords and this karma is coming back to you okay and um, um at the end of the week is as if no one wants to work with you because here you have the queen of swords and the queen of swords stands up against you the queen of swords stands up against you so let's look and see what has transpired between you and the king of swords and the seven of pentacles um there's a lot of situation that has happened because you have the ten of wands you have the energy of the ten of wands so whatever has happened you have now a burden that's why you're having regrets let's see in the middle of the week what has happened between seven of Pentacles and two of Pentacles the tower 
blows up the tower blows up let's see what is happening with the two of Pentacles and the Queen of Swords you're having some emotional regrets okay it's all about you guys are having regrets let's see what is transpiring in the first part of the week you have a situation with an organization and uh, with the, the, the king of swords and um, the seven of pentacles you really having a situation with an organization so you're having some really regrets of something that you did and then the energy of the tower it's all about money um, this is um, two four the ten of pentacles okay so um, whatever it is you're having a situation because um, your financial situation because um, this is going to be um, the um, the outcomes of your week it's all about some financial situation whatever you did there is some financial situation and you have a lot of hidden enemies and um, they're coming out at the end of the week a lot of hidden enemies is coming out at the end of the week let's see what is happening with regrets and you're looking inwards with a family situation you did something to a family member and you're looking inwards at this now because the energy of the organization and the burden so you have two times ten in um, your reading and then um, the last outcome is that um, whatever the love that there was is no longer there okay so whatever the situation was whatever that has transpired in your life it's as if um, it, it, it's all about money you did something that has to do with money it's as if um, some of you had um, sell out someone for money give information to the king of swords about someone for money and it, it is all about money your focus is so all about money and now an organization is looking at you and thinking oh my god how can you really do this situation um, to someone who has been always there so is your karma coming back to you whatever your karma as it was good it's gonna come back good to you if it was bad because obviously you're seeing here a situation that is as if you sold out someone to an organization and now the karma is coming back to you and this karma that is coming back to you people are th turning their backs on you because the love is going um, the other way they're turning your backs on you because this is the outcome and they're turning their backs on you because um, and your family is turning your family or organization is turning their backs on you because of a situation that has transpired okay so it's as if it's a karmatic situation because it's the wheel of fortune and the wheel of fortune comes in because what has transpired is that whatever you have done to someone else this is coming back at you in full circles the wheel of fortune is bringing back this karma this week is all about karma it's not about your luck or that thing this week is all about karmas because whatever you had given out it's coming back to you and your focus is all about money and this situation that happened it's all about money you are having so many regrets okay because here um, the family um, you're turning your back or the family is turning their backs because um, the um, and your son if you have a son that is and um, if you have a son that is um, a, 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 a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, they're turning their backs on you and I think it's a scorpion person because um, they're turning their backs on you because of whatever situation that has transpired it's a karmatic situation so for you here is you know and it could be um, it's it, it has to do with an Aries that has something because it's as if your son find out what you did your son found out that you used him for a situation and he's turning his back on you you know and an organization he's 
really turning your back because there's a lot of regrets that is coming in there you're thinking about it and you can see this playing out because the tower is here it's all about money you sold out someone for money and your son is turning it's back on you because you realize he realized what you have done you sold out someone for money and he's seen exactly who you are it is a karmatic situation because the wheel of fortune ten of cups is here and the ten of wands um, and the tens are all in the beginning of the week a burden with the, the, the you know and an organization that sort of a thing there's a lot of regrets that you know you're having and that sort of a thing it it was all about the focus of money and that um, you you know sold out someone for your own benefits and this is coming back to eat you up because in the middle of the week you're thinking about what you have done and um, uh, and, and you're seeing oh my god um, I shouldn't have done that and your son is actually turning your back and and, and, and looking forward um, because of what you have done so um, whoever you are out there be aware of what is happening because um, whenever you do these things to people um, it's gonna come back to you and you're going to be so surprised at what transpired and this is what that transpired here so you know think twice before you're going to think from all your ego base that I'm going to because of money and because I need money I'm going to sell out someone because your conscience is going to come in on Saturday and and, and Sunday no one wants to deal with you because your conscience is going to come in and you know you're going to have regrets because it's going to be a regretful thing and it's uh, it's all about money why you because the money is the center so you did it because of money um, and that is the center you did it because of money and that sort of a thing and that is what is going to affect you okay you have to find inner strength in this week whatever is happening you have to find inner strength in this week and um, this is the only thing that is going to happen for you is to find the inner strength because it's a karmatic situation that you're dealing with I want to say to each and every person um, the energy vibration for the next portal is already up go and listen to that room to listen to the Sun moon horizon sign for the birthday people remember that your um, birthday um, reading is up go look at your birthday reading because this is going to help you a lot namaste until next week yeah.